So first off, what we're going to do is have each one of our panelists introduce themselves, your name, your title, where you work, and um, how you got into that job, which seems like a big question. So maybe just focused on the easier parts. So let's start with um, James. Okay, thanks, Madison, and, and hello, everyone. Uh, also, thanks to Hannah, Madison, James, and the others, everyone, for organizing this and, and inviting me along. Um, so, yeah, I'm James Muirhead. Um, my position is a lecturer um, at the University of Auckland, uh, New Zealand. Um, a lecturer is similar to an assistant professor um, in, the, in the United States. Uh, and it involves for the 40-40-20 model, 40% teaching, 40% research, 20% uh, service, and the kind of typical stuff like uh, supervising uh, graduate students um, and things like that. And I just started um, in January this year. So um, it's not, it's, I haven't settled into sort of the typical schedule, I think that you get into probably in your second year. Um, so that's where I'm at right now. Did, was there something else you wanted me to add in there, Madison? Um, no, that's probably good for now. Let's move on to, I guess, May. Uh, hi, thanks for having me and thanks for organizing this. Uh, my name is Mai and I'm a geochemistry research associate at Western Washington University. Um, I am more of the, I guess, technical lab tech side of things. So my primary position is to work with the department here it has a laser ablation inductively coupled plasma mass spectrometer. So my job is to um, work on and maintain um, and teach people how to use the LAICPMS. Um, I also teach during the academic year. So I do, um, we have a quarter system, so I teach about one class per quarter or as needed, um, yeah. Cool, thank you. All right, how about Natalia? Hi everyone, thanks as well for inviting and for organizing this. Um, so I'm Natalia Pardo, I'm here in Colombia. I, I'm an assistant professor at the University of Los Andes in the capital city. And uh, um, then the, the assistant professorship here uh, is a three-year tenure track position. And after that, then you're officially involved into the university. Mm -hmm. um, basically, my duties are teaching. Teaching is the, is the main duty. But we also have um, a very young department in geosciences. So we're very involved in hiring new positions in the administrative issues in building new labs and um, we have also to search for fundings and um, and supervise students we only have undergraduate for the moment so we try to do as much as we can with undergraduates and then link with other universities and international colleagues for phds and graduate research level and uh, in colombia we're very used uh, to do something that we call extension, which is uh, basically the social output of what we do. So as far as we do research outside in the field, we also link with the communities living in the volcanoes. And um, so we're basically work all the year round <laughs> and um, very few holidays, but um, that's, that's how it works here. Thank you. All right, and then Caroline. Hello, um, thank you very much for organizing this panel and for having me here. Um, so my name is Caroline Bouvet de Maisonneur, and I'm an assistant professor at the Earth Observatory of Singapore and also the Asian School of the Environment, um, both in Singapore. I actually have two hats because the Earth Observatory is um, a research center hosted by the Nanyang Technological University, whilst the Asian School of the Environment is actually a proper um, school. So that's where PhDs, undergraduates, and all of these activities uh, happen. Um, I started this position in 2014, so it's been six years now. And um, 
I do um, a large fraction of research, um, some teaching. We have semesters and I teach a bit more than one class per semester. Um, we have an outreach office, part of the Earth Observatory, and, um, and we try to work as closely as possible with the outreach office. It's certainly not as much as what's done in Colombia and other places, but it's probably um, uh, maybe sometimes a bit different from, from more traditional departments. And um, what else? Um, yeah, I think I'm on a tenure track clock as well. And, uh, and so, yeah, for me. Cool, thank you.